Chris, I need an explosion to get out for a while. I have been working on mesh porting. Ever since I stopped using Unity for a while, I started moving back to Roblox, and I have been using. And I have been using this way to bring some meshes from Sonic Riders into Roblox. There are barely any meshes for Sonic Riders boards and whatever, so I'm going to be the first one to do that. Every board you see here is actually from the PC version of Sonic Riders. So done with zero gravity. Okay. Yes, I'm fine, thank you. As I was saying, I've been working on this stuff for a long time. And, you know, my these cores haven't been put to work. I can't add this because I have to reverse the polys for it. But once I've uploaded uh, Type J, Type W, Type S, Boost, uh, Boost R2, Boost R, Yelltail, and the E gear. These ones over here I have never not uploaded yet. The Destroyer, Yellow Pottons, or whatever, whatever the heck it's called. The uh, Trap Gear, the Blue Star from Zero Gravity. But yeah, hold on. Actually, let me just do this now. So, Roblox. I'm do this now while I'm out. Um, Alright, so where am I getting the information from? I'm just jumping over here. We just have to see here. It says flight type for kids. This board is used by Queen the Rabbit. Submit. And we're good. Close it up. Presentation. There's an actual gear I want to upload, so right click, save Roblox. Roblox had UV mapping that actually put in the, uh, what's that? Gear for, uh, the UV maps for the uh, air stuff. Here it is. A war is no, I do not want you to play advertisements, and I do not want to be copyrighted by Disney, because they always copyright everything. No, 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 no. I hate advertisements so goddamn much. I hate advertising so much. Excuse my language, but. Presentation. If I actually get censored for that by Roblox, I'm going to be very disappointed because apparently that has nothing. Alright, so. Thanks, guy. one here, so with this, hopefully I don't get another advertisement that will actually, that will actually, oh, that, oh, there we go, advertisement, this time we got something for Target, you know, whenever I do this stuff, it'd be a good idea to add an ad blocker, but I won't be able to, because some websites will be disabled for it, so, that'll probably hashtag that. Alright. So yeah, I've been actually working on this stuff for a while, and yet, nobody's taken notice of it. If you wish to use any of these boards, I will be happy to give you the files for them. 
But as for uh, the Red Rock, I am keeping that one until I can actually fix up that model because it's inside out. Let's check what I'm talking about. Here, let me rotate it. No, I'll actually raise it up first, so move it up. Alright, now there's light on the up part. Now I have a flash trap when I switch those down. Now that's the top part. But according that this is actually the top part, and if I move it down with the other boards, it's kind of a. Uh, let me just say this, it's kind of darkened out the top part, which isn't helpful because Roblox's lighting is kind of messed up. So yeah, I gotta fix this one, and that's about it. So let me file, so let me save that. Back to my Roblox page. I've been match testing a lot of stuff, so I'm gonna go back to this one because I want to fix these ones up over here because I never touched them. <coughs> I never touched these models. Ever since these are models, they were the first ones I poured it over. Here's the Doomerine helmet. This is a mush part, right? Yep, it's a do it's a mush part. Let me fix that up. But yeah, this is a uh, Doomerine helmet. Little combat thing over here, Stimpy from Young Stimpy. The Borderlands uh, mask over here. The gauntlet, which I'm actually working on over here. Now, this one is supposed to go inside the thing and act like a buzzsaw for the gauntlet. This is from Quake 3. Didn't think Roblox would accept it, but they actually did. The C4 from Counter Strike. The error sign from Darius Mod. We all know that. Uh, we have the uh, companion cube, the portal button. The camera, actually, let me move this. Actually, I didn't actually notice this, so let me delete that and we'll scale this to the left. This is like the security camera from Portal if you want, if you guys remember that. It hangs on the wall just like that. <coughs> and we have the radio, which actually has a texture inside out right here. As you can see, This Doomerine helmet is actually from a Quake, uh, or from a Gary's Mod uh, add-on, so whoever is the maker of this helmet, yep. Yeah, I used it in the Roblox game, sorry about that. We have the uh, Quake symbol, if I can pick, let me scale this a bit. There we go. This is the quad damage thing from Quake. Loved Quake when I was younger. Anyway, yeah. That's all I've been working on for a while. I've been putting meshes, and um, I don't think anybody's been taking notice. Good. Anybody who wants to take notice and use any of these things, I do not mind, but I have to be credited for porting the meshes. But still, credit the original makers of these models. Because uh, these are just meshes I grabbed. <laughs> This one, all right, let me explain this one. So uh, back when uh, Tattletale Roleplay was around, if you remember it, I was working on putting portal meshes for, uh, for like some kind of thing for uh, GMD, for the uh, G uh, GMD Corp area. And what happened was was that uh, I don't think, uh, what happened was was that I don't think I got a reply back on the meshes. So I completely forgot about it and I just left it here. So let me just delete this now because it's probably not going to be needed anyway. Very disappointing indeed. Ugh. Anyways, I will let you all see you guys later.